The death of Friends star Matthew Perry continues to reverberate as the world waits for word on what led to the 54-year-old star's death. He was found unresponsive in his hot tub by his assistant, with paramedics saying they were responding to a drowning. Jim Murray begins our coverage. We're learning new details today about Matthew Perry's final hours. The Friends actor spent the morning playing pickleball. He was said to be obsessed with the sport and reportedly played the game twice a day for two hours. But on Saturday, he called it quits after just one hour because he was fatigued. After pickleball, Matthew Perry returned here to his $6 million mansion in Pacific Palisades. He asked his assistant to run some errands for him, picking up a new iPhone and prescription glasses. Meanwhile, the beloved actor relaxed in his hot tub. It was his favorite place to unwind. In fact, his last social media post one week ago was this image of himself in his hot tub with the caption, oh, so warm water swirling around makes you feel good? Perry's assistant returned at 4 p.m. and that's when she made the shocking discovery. The actor had drowned. Page 23, rescue 23, you missed my response to the drowning. First responders converged on the quiet neighborhood. That's Perry's mother, Suzanne, and stepfather, Dateline NBC's true crime correspondent, Keith Morrison. It was a tragic scene made all the more poignant by Morrison's presence as he lifts the police tape to pay his respects to Matthew's biological father, actor John Perry. According to reports, cops found prescription painkillers and anti-anxiety pills at Matthew Perry's home, along with medication to treat COPD, a breathing disorder like emphysema. Perry had struggled with drug and alcohol addiction for decades. He was in recovery, although just last week he looked disheveled and overweight. Why is a healthy, communicative, able-bodied gentleman like this suddenly pass away in a hot tub? You know, there has to be something sort of underlying. Forensic pathologist Dr. Priya Banerjee says it's unlikely Perry simply fell asleep because natural reflexes would have kicked in and jolted him awake. Something has to be going on to then alter his reflexes. It doesn't have to always be drugs. You know, you have to think about medical conditions, anything that can alter someone. The heat of the hot tub could also have been a factor. Someone who plays pickleball might be a little bit more fatigued than usual, a little more dehydrated, may then jump into a hot tub, which makes them further dehydrated. As a result, there can be some demand placed on the heart, increased stress. Requesting two additional units and a supervisor respond to Blue Sail Drive. The aerial footage of Perry's pool revealed a curious image on the bottom. It's the bat sign. He was a huge Batman fan. His social media is filled with Batman images. He even called himself Matman. The caption on this October 19th post showing the bat signal in his pool lit up goes, sleep well everybody, I've got the city tonight. Matt Mann. Perry's grieving family released a statement today. We are heartbroken by the tragic loss of our beloved son and brother. Matthew brought so much joy to the world.